Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. And a very good day. I'm Miss K and today we're going to solve two problems on the topic of division of fractions. So let's not waste any more time. Let's look at the first question. All right. For the first question, we have 2, 1 over 2 divided by 5 over 6. So the first thing that you need to do is to convert the mixed numbers into improper fractions. Okay, kita tukarkan nombor bercampur kepada pecahan tak wajah. So, using the same method as always, we'll have 5 over 2. Now, we change the symbol of division into multiplication. So, when we change this, we need to uh, change also the 5 over 6 into 6 over 5. So, the numerator becomes the denominator and the denominator becomes the numerator. Okay, pengangka menjadi penyebut dan penyebut menjadi pengangka. Okay, kita songsangkan sebab kita dah tukar bahagi kepada darab. Okay, so for this equation, we can uh, simplify the fractions using the cancelling of numbers. Okay, when we have the same numbers in the same multiplication tables, we can divide the numbers. So 5 and 5, we can divide by 5, okay, becomes 1. And 2 and 6, in the multiplication tables of 2, we can divide by 2. So 2 becomes 1 and 6 becomes 3. Okay, now we just multiply the numerators 1 and 3, and we multiply the denominators 1 and 1. When we have 3 over 1, we can just write the final answer as 3. Okay, for question number two, from the question, we know that the number of friends that had a piece of cake is the unknown. Okay, bilangan kawan yang dapat cake itu adalah satu anu, satu bilangan yang, uh, satu nilai yang kita tak ketahui. So, we can write the equation as this, 1 over 2 divided by an unknown, and each of them got 1 over 10 part of the cake. So to find the unknown, we can use the same concept as a regular division. So let me give you an example. Okay, let's say this one. 10 divided by an unknown equals 5. So we know that the unknown is 2. 10 divided by 2 is 5. But how do we find the unknown? Okay, so we can use the concept 10 divided by 5 to get the answer 2. So, using the same concept, to find the unknown, we can just use the equation 1 over 2 divided by 1 over 10. So, in this division, we can change the symbol into the symbol of multiplication. And by doing that, we need to change 1 over 10 to 10 over 1. Okay, pengangka menjadi penyebut. Penyebut menjadi pengangka. The same thing that happens in the first question. So for this one, we can use the uh, cancelling of numbers. We simplify the, the fractions. Okay, 2 and 10 is the same uh, numbers that is in the multiplication tables of 2. So 2 divided by 2 becomes 1. And 10 divided by 2 becomes 5. So you have 5 over 1. And we can just write the final answer as 5. Okay, so that's it for today. I hope that you will understand the two problems that are being shown. So until the next lesson, thank you. Assalamualaikum and goodbye.